The State Patrol tells us that Memorial Day through Labor Day marks the 100 deadliest days on Minnesota roads. During that stretch of time last year, 120 people died on roadways in the state. Those deaths account for more than 30 percent of the state's traffic deaths in 2016. WCCO's Rush Chapman has more on what's being done to bring that number down. Memorial Day weekend is considered the unofficial beginning of summer, and for Minnesota, it ushers in some of the deadliest days on Minnesota roads. This next 100 days is when we will see uh, a significant number of our fatalities. Captain Mike Hansen says speeds increase when temperatures rise. He says warm weather is a big factor in the rise of fatalities during the next 100 days. We have a short window period to enjoy summer in Minnesota, and uh, as a consequence, people tend to get in a hurry. We're distracted. We're trying to do too many things at once. Captain Hansen says with all the congestion and construction projects across the state, drivers should focus on the road. Distracted and impaired driving are two things pushing the number of traffic fatalities up between Memorial and Labor Days. Hansen says there are ways to protect yourself when on the road. Always, always, always make sure you and everybody in the vehicle has that seatbelt buckled up. That is your best defense against a mistake being made by another driver. The second part of that is having to do with paying attention. State troopers will be out in full force, phasing in seatbelt and distracted driving enforcement throughout the next 100 days. Captain Hansen says if Minnesota motorists watch their speed, avoid distractions, wear seatbelts, and don't drive impaired, we have a chance of breaking the cycle of an increase in traffic deaths this summer. Reg Chapman, WCCO, 4 News. The Department of Public Safety says there have been 115 fatalities on Minnesota roads so far this year, and that is 10 fewer than at this time last year. State troopers hope that decline is a sign that educating the public is paying off.